Hi guys, welcome back to Dee's Kitchen. So today we're going to cook Southern Baked Candy Yams. So for this recipe, you will need four pounds of sweet potato cut and washed. You will need butter, sugar, brown sugar, ground nutmeg, ground ginger, ground allspice, ground cinnamon, and vanilla flavor. So let's get started. So I have sliced and washed my potatoes. So I'm just gonna put those to the side. I have my oven preheated at 350. And I have a pot here, so you want to turn your eye on low, medium heat. So I have my between four and five, my eye. And you want to get your butter, which I have two tablespoons of butter here. Okay. You want your butter to melt and you want to add your sugar so I have one cup of sugar okay so you want to let your butter and your sugar melt you want your butter to melt with your sugar. So after I get the butter condensed down just a little bit, we're gonna add our brown sugar. I normally don't use this, this pan I usually use my deeper pan, so I'm gonna try not to make a mess. But you wanna add your brown sugar, which is one fourth cup. mix it around until the butter is completely melted so next we're going to add our nutmeg So you wanna add your nutmeg, which I have ground nutmeg here and I have a half a teaspoon. I'm sorry, that was sugar, cinnamon. I'm sorry, half a nutmeg here, but you're gonna add the cinnamon too, but it's a half a teaspoon of nutmeg. I was adding my cinnamon already. ground cinnamon which now you want to add your ground cinnamon which is going to be one teaspoon of ground cinnamon and your ginger I have a half a teaspoon of ginger all spice here I have one fourth of all spice here. And you want to add 
your vanilla flavor, which is going to it's going to be one tablespoon of vanilla flavor. short a little vanilla flavor so I gotta add a little bit more but I don't want this to sit and stick so with all those you're just gonna combine all those ingredients together Once you get all the ingredients together, you want it to come to a slow simmer. We have came to a slow simmer. That's what you want. Now I'm just gonna mix it around really good. Now you want to turn off your eye and you want to pour this on top of your sweet potatoes. sweet potatoes I know it don't look like it's a whole lot but it's gonna cook down the potatoes gonna shrink a little and it's gonna make juice so we're just gonna place aluminum foil on it and we're gonna cook it for 30 minutes we're gonna check it out This one will pour you really loud. So, we place the new foil on it. We're going to place it in the oven. We're going to cook it for 30 minutes. And then we're going to take it out and we're going to check it. It's been 30 minutes, so we're just going to check on our potatoes. Smells really good. Now we're just gonna flip them over so they can cook evenly on the other side as well. Do. This is not required. I'm just going to do it. I'm going to take some of the juices out. And I'm just going to base the top of them. Place our aluminum foil back on. And we're going to cook for a remaining 30 minutes.
It's been 30 minutes. So we're just gonna check on our sweet potatoes. So they are done. They are tender. They soft, they no longer hard. Um, I cut mine like really thin so that um, it won't take so long to cook. But um, if you have thick potatoes, you can just slide them back in there for additional time. But if not, then you're all good to go. There we have it. Southern style baked sweet potatoes. Or candy yams. I hope you guys enjoyed my video of my southern baked candy yams if you haven't subscribed please make sure you go down and subscribe below also comment and like this video and as always thanks for watching bye